What's going on YouTube? It's your boy Apollo and we're back with another For Honor video. Now in today's video, I got some ranked gameplay because I've been playing some ranked. I'm trying to gauge how good I am in comparison to before. Uh, in year two of the game, I peaked at power rank 16 in the world. So right now, actually, we can go check if we go to profile, we can go to ranking. And I am in the top 44%. So I'm not even on the top 100 list at all. But I am in the top 44% of players, which is over average, which is good for someone not playing the game for three years. That's very good. Um, but yeah, we're getting back into ranked. We're going to go as high as we can, engage what our peak skill level is. And when we get there... I don't know what we'll do. We'll probably try to find some people that are also around that skill level uh, and play with them, spar with them, try to get even better and improve. And yeah, but today's video is nothing like that. Today's video is simply some ranked games I got. Um, actually, some, some pretty decent players for Gold 4. It was kind of surprising. Um, I, I was Gold 2 at the start of the video. I'll be Gold 4 by the end of it which just tells me there's not nearly that many players as there used to be. Um, cause like basically how rank systems work, the more players there are, the higher, the harder it is to go up a rank. Um, because you're being compared to everyone else who's also fighting. So yeah, there's not as many players as there used to be, but I'll take it, man. Cause less players means more determined players, which means once I get up into, if I can get to plat, It'll be all really, really good players. I hope I don't find any, like, hyper armor abusers or full guard abusers like I have in the lower ranks. Um, but if I do, that's fine. I'll just try to learn ways around them. The one thing I am scared of, though, terrified of Black Prior. Because Black Prior's full guard is different because he can actually counter my kick. The only way to get a Black Prior out of their full guard is to guard break them. Which is scary, because my main tool against Kyoshin and Conqueror is to kick them and light them. It's that simple. It makes them not want a full guard anymore, even though it's only a little bit of damage, and that opens them up to a lot of other attacks. So that's been my usual tool, but if I run into a high rank Black Prior, they are going to abuse their full guard, and it's going to be a very hard fight for me. Um, <laughs> I won't hold you guys any longer. I'll let you get to the video and yeah, let's go there. Ask me anything down in the comments. I bet you I answer, answer that whole lickety split here. It's a Griffin. A rep one Griffin evade Zeus. Please don't be a good player. Round one. Why play toxic if you can't handle me being toxic back? Po 
pussy! Fuck is you talking about, bro? He's really running the golden wings, bro. That's crazy. I didn't realize he was out of stamina. I would have let him get it back. I've never seen a Shaolin run out of stamina that fast before. I thought he had like a really high stamina pool. Give up, bro. It's not that serious. You're literally playing the best character in the game. Why would you give up? I'm genuinely confused. That was not even a bad round for you. There you go. He, at least he tried to fight that Victory. time. The trick to beating my Orochi, by the way, uh, <laughs> it's simple, really. And then it'll work out fine for you. Ooh, another gold three. This will be fun. By the way, I'm only doing ranked videos because my friend from like year one, Elite X Chaos, you can look him up on YouTube. He does ranked videos, and I just figured maybe ranked is a more um, efficient way for me to get better at the game. So yeah, I'm gonna do some ranked. Probably until I hit plat. I think plat is where I'll give it some time because diamond, it looks easy watching his videos because elite is in diamond. It looks easy watching his videos, but uh, Ah, uh, I don't, I doubt it's as easy as he makes it look. Oh, there he goes. He got me out of stamina. Ow. <laughs> he, uh, he definitely sold the bag there. He has two unblockables that he could have done to force a 50-50 and then he could have guard broke, throw me on the ground and gotten two free hits. Instead, he chose to challenge my block, which didn't work out. I don't know why he did that. That was really weird. Um, I guess because it's only gold, maybe people aren't thinking that hard, but... Okay, he got that. Ugh. Believe it or not, I wonder, because I've watched a couple of my videos and it looks like I'm just throwing attacks, but I actually am predicting what they're gonna do and then basing my attack off of that. Like, yes, I do generally play by just throwing as many attacks as possible. Um, and that that is for one simple reason. My reaction speed right now is not as fast as it used to be. So I can't deflect as much as I'd like to. Um, and with me not being able to deflect, I am at more of a disadvantage than I've probably ever been playing this game. So I am compensating by throwing out a lot of attacks. And it's not permanent. This isn't like my new play style or anything. It's just this is the best way for me to compensate right now. And once I get, because I've been practicing off camera, I've been practicing deflects a lot. And once I get probably around only Orochi's level, uh, I'll go back to playing how I would like to. But for now, this is the best option for me, so I have to do it. Um, 
and I hope it's not boring to watch. Probably do one more match for this video. Rep 8 Nabushi. Huh. So people don't know this very much, but Nabushi is actually a perfect counter to my playstyle because if you keep me at range, there's not really anything I can do. And my best option against a Nabushi is to try to break inside of their range. Which I have done successfully, and now I can just pummel her. And then once I get low on stamina, I gotta back up a little bit. Oh! oh, that was way too close. I didn't realize she could get that much damage in such a short amount of time. I also have to work on my parries, but that just goes back to what I was saying last game about um, my reaction speed not being fast enough. And also my frames are set capped at 30 FPS and I'm getting about 28 per game. Huh, I wasn't far enough away to get out of that. Oh, oh, good fight, bro. This guy's actually so good at fucking countering me. I can't really, he seems like he's a good Nabushi too. Um, Cause I was gonna say, I can't really tell how good he is as I am a lot worse than I used to be. So what is a good player to me right now probably wasn't a good player to me back in the day. Oh, I'm dead here. Wait, give me one health to survive. No? Fuck. By the way, that parry was predicted. It was, Or that deflect was predicted. It wasn't reactionary. Only Orochi's deflects are reactionary. There's a bit of a difference there. Okay, he buried that. I tried to deflect that. Yep. All right. Well, guys, that's the last game of this video. I'll catch you in the outro. But yeah, that was really fun. That guy was really good. I liked that a lot. All right, guys, that's going to be the end of this video. I meant to say in the intro, I am so sorry for the background noise. I had my door open. My little sister decided to throw a fit. You guys know how it goes. Uh, I've had background noise in other videos. I'm trying to work on it, and I'm also working on moving out. So eventually there will be absolutely zero background noise. I'll have a better setup. I can edit videos better. You get what you pay for, man. You guys, I'm trying to do my best for you. Um, so yeah, like I said, that Nabushi specifically was pretty damn good. Uh... The Shaolin, I feel like if he didn't give up, he had a chance, but he just, I don't know, like, it, it's really hard when you're actually playing the game because you get to this point where it's like, okay, I could think really hard and try to figure out a way to beat this guy, but it's so frustrating that you didn't instantly know how to, that it almost like makes your brain shut down and you're just like, dude, fuck it. I'm not even gonna try, like, this guy can have it, whatever, it's easier that way, it's faster, like, just get it over with, right? You get to that point, um, especially in fighting games. Shooting games, it's more like, okay, well, I have a gun, so I'm a little more confident, but in fighting games, it, it can get stressful, man, and, uh, so yeah, all the love to that Shaolin, I hope he progresses to be as good of a player as I know he can be. And with that being said, this rank video is